Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video of Clash of Clans. We're loading in, as you can see, 25 million of gold elixir and 250,000 on dark elixir from last season. The golden pass has really come through for us. We have collected the maximum amount. I'm taking up a screenshot of that, check if we're recording. You know, you never know if you're not recording, so always good to double check. Start a clock tower. I don't know, it's sometimes weird with the clock tower. It's just like weird. Uh, timing. So here's some offers. Mm, they're actually pretty good. Uh, book of building, builder potion, research potion for just three pounds. That's really good if you consider the one on the left, which had two books and that was for f five pounds. Uh, another golden pass, Rogue King. Uh, I don't know how I feel about it. I know the, they released the Archer Queen. It looked kind of good. Uh, but you know, we don't buy the golden pass for the skins, we buy it for the resources it gives and for the extra potions and books that will really help to speed up your process. Um, as I can see, it's kind of the usual layout. Uh, the challenges destroy 500 walls, seven times destroy 25 barbarian killing altars, 20, 250 building. 250 building should be quite easy to do as well as the 500 uh, walls and versus battles. Uh, so let's see the village, which is like my progress village. As you can see, oh no, <laughs> I timed this completely wrong uh, because my archer queen still has 19 hours to go. There are these books, but I don't want to really buy another book of heroes. Um, if I'm going to get the offer, I'm going to get the 999 one. Um, okay. Um, I don't actually know what to do now because... My archer queen is upgraded. Gotten, as you can see, um, and now we can go up to the at least ten percent builder boost because uh, I don't want my um, I don't want to waste money paying full price when I already have the golden pass. So I'm gonna do the five hundred wall segments and versus battles, um, and that will give me. Uh, uh, give me the 10% discount. As you can see the hero skin is kind of cool. Actually, he has like a massive crown on his right arm, really small crown on his head. <laughs> and the pose is kind of cool, I guess. But I think the animated king is not going to get beaten anytime soon. So I'm going to keep that. Um, nothing too exciting in clan news. Clash World Leaks start tomorrow, that's about it. As you can see my bomb tower, 7 million. I don't know actually what to upgrade, should I upgrade the big bomb tower next? I think I might go for the uh, already upgraded bomb tower and just get that out of the way because it's such an expensive upgrade. Completely full. In clan games, we can get some stuff and uh, the resources are gonna go into treasury. But as you can see, my wall rigs are full, so I can't really complete the um, fourth row. So I'm going to have to spend some of those wall rings in my builder base, I think. Um, yeah, because it, it's so inefficient to spend wall rings not in your builder village. Oh no, my auto is upgrading as well. Something. Okay. We came back. Um, and now we're gonna, as you can see, my auto finished, so I can spend the wall rings finally. Um, and we can, and we can start upgrading our home village. I'll get the builder potion to get everything running much faster. The archer queen will be done. I, I'll probably just gem her. Uh, I'd say 14 gems. Yeah, 14 gems. That's not too bad, especially that I'm maxed out gem mine and makes three gems a day. And now let's start um, with gemming her up. And should we start with walls? Um, wow, 180,000 dark elixir. That's quite a lot if you think about it. We'll upgrade her though because level 45, her ability gets better so we can finally deplete our dark elixir amount because it's just been full for the for a really really long time and now i have a dilemma because i don't really know what to upgrade as you can see we get the 
10% builder bonus. Oh, I probably should have used that when I was upgrading the queen, but to be fair, I'm probably gonna fill up my dark elixir storage anyways really soon because I literally have nothing to upgrade. Crash, Clash World Leaks is coming and I don't want to spend, um, I don't want to upgrade my heroes when it's Clash World League week. So free books of building, that can really help us out. Um, but yeah, it's a tough decision now because I don't actually know what to upgrade. Mortars are good, um, but the bombed, oh yeah, the cannon definitely. I definitely want to upgrade the cannon. We, we don't want to have one cannon that's not max level for the town 11. Uh, so that's definitely on my priority list. Um, air sweepers, I know they're good, but I don't think they're like super priority because yeah, because they're, they're gonna be max level if I upgrade them and I wanna first max out my other defenses. Um, so yeah, all the books are quite far up, so I could, I'm not gonna be able to use those. Wow, no books of building. Whoa, no books of building. Okay, that's not very good. No books of building and the gold pass. Let's start with vaults then. Uh, 2 million 700,000, that's as much of a reduction as I can ask for really. Um, let's start with gold. Let's do, yeah, let's do those three with gold and then go in, into an elixir because the gold is much more important than, than gold at this, no, gold is much more <laughs> important than the elixir at this stage. Yeah, let's get that builder potion and let's increase the speed of our builders. Um, and let's upgrade walls with elixir. We go one, we get two, <laughs> we get three, we get four, we get five. We would expect to get 10 because 30 million, 3 million per wall, 10 walls. Um, but then again, I want to keep some elixir behind. But yeah, we get the 10 and I think that's enough. I want to keep some elixir for my uh, laboratory. That's going to finish quite soon. Um, oh yeah, still have to do those wall rings. So let's choose the walls. As you can see, I choose the walls which have free, uh, free wall ring cost because the next one four ring, that's for the next stage. Uh, but let's finish those up Two two walls upgraded. Well, two times five, so 10. And then choose the six, shovel, gold elixir, builder, uh, gold uh, rune. Um, and I'll go for the Book of Fighting and the Rune of Elixir for the home village. And I think that's the best combination. As you can see, I can choose the Rune of Elixir as well because I completed the clan games. So looking good, looking good. Rewards claimed. And now, as you can see, this is weird. I, I was first to complete the clan games and I'm still like fourth. I don't know why. I think it might be because they completed like a challenge that gave them more uh, medals. Um, when they were when they were close to four thousand, uh, collect the elixir from the, um, oh what's the name? Oh my god, I forgot. <laughs> Gold mine and elixir collectors from the collectors. Um, and yeah, I think we're just gonna upgrade the cannon. Although, hmm, I'm tempted to get this bomb tower upgraded. So I'm thinking if we. Yeah, so now it's upgrading, but it's gonna take a while. I think we can use one of the books of uh, building and then, because you can see it's nine days to upgrade the bomb tower. So it's gonna be a huge reduction in the time required to um, max out town 11. But then again, I probably want another book of building. So I might buy that 9.99 offer. Okay, um, do I have anything in the treasury? I'm wondering. Let's check. Oh, that was quite a lot of gold from the mines. Oh, I got 1.5 million. That's going to be helpful uh, when my next builder becomes available. But you know what? Let's... I think we're going to get the offer. 990. It looks so tempting. You get two books. And these books are really good. Book of everything. You can use it on anything. Literally anything. Whether troops buildings so let's use the book of building i'll zoom in boom 
bomb tower level six. How cool is that? That looks amazing. Wow. Okay, let's let's buy the offer. Okay, the offer was bought. We get six million, two more books, which is gonna help r rapidly increase the rate of our uh, progress. And now dilemma: Do we upgrade the mortar? Six million three hundred, five days, nine hours, or do we go for the cannon? As you can see, I have cannons finishing up basically. Well, basically finishing up. I've I'm upgrading the rest and. Huh. It's a tough choice because I feel like cannon is more useful. So we can upgrade cannon to level 15. That's going to take us 6,300,000 gold as well. Yeah, I think cannon, cannon was the good choice right there. Next, the mortars on the priority list and then air sweepers. And yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. And I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.